Hello, everyone. Hope everyone's having a good evening tonight. I uh, came on here to go live uh, before going to bed tonight to lead a 20-minute guided meditation for relaxation and sleep. Um, the practice that we're going to do is called uh, Yoga Nidra, and it's a really simple practice. It's one that I do pretty much every night before I go to bed and sometimes during the day when I'm having trouble sleeping um, and uh, or I'm sorry, when I'm feeling like I'm having a lot of tension uh, in my body and I'm having kind of trouble processing it. And it's a really simple practice. One of the great things about this practice is that you don't need to assume any special body postures. You uh, don't need to do anything with your body at all. You can practice the, uh, you can do the practice laying down uh, on your couch or in your bed, or you can do it in a chair. So it's really simple. So if you feel like you want to give it a try, um, you can set your phone down right now, maybe plug in your headphones or set your computer off to the side. Just close your eyes right where you're at, or if you feel like you want to wait and use the practice to help you fall asleep when you're ready for bed, you can start the video over at that time, maybe put in your headphones then and just lay down, listen to the video, and just use it as a way to help you fall asleep. So whenever you're ready, go ahead and find your comfortable position. Like I said, sitting down in a chair, maybe laying down in your bed or on a couch. And close your eyes. When you close your eyes, start to bring your attention to your body. And just start to notice what's present in your body. And start to notice your breathing. And then take a moment to notice what's happening in your mind. What thoughts are present? Not inviting any particular thoughts to come or pushing any thoughts away. Just engaging whatever arises in your field of experience with a welcoming attitude. And then take a moment now to consider your intention. And what do you hope to manifest or release through this practice? Considering first a short-term intention. Do you need release from stress or help settling down or maybe a good night's rest. And then if you have a longer term intention, take a moment to consider that as well. Where do you hope that this practice might take you over time. If you're working with some kind of longer term intention in another practice, maybe you can bring that into your mind now. And if you find it helpful, maybe you can formulate your longer term intention 
in a short, simple statement in the present tense. I am loving kindness. I am free. I am healthy, whole, and present. Whatever it is, take a moment to start to feel right now that longer term intention. Now bring your attention back to your physical body. And start by bringing your attention to your mouth. Notice your tongue in your mouth. If you find that your tongue is stuck up on the roof of your mouth, just let it release down from the roof of your mouth. And start to notice the feeling of the roof of your mouth, the floor of your mouth, the feeling of your teeth and your lips. And allow your attention to travel up your jaw to the hinge of your jaw, noticing if there's any tension present in your jaw. Feeling your cheeks and the area around your eyes. Feeling your lids closed over your eyes. Start to notice if there's any tension around your eyes. Feeling your nose and your breath entering and exiting at the tip of your nose. And letting your attention travel back to your ears. Feel your inner ear, noticing any sounds that might be present in your inner ear. Feeling your outer ear structure of your ear. And feeling your forehead and your scalp. Letting your attention travel all the way up to the crown of your head. Noticing any tingling or subtle sensations that might be present at the crown of your head. And then letting your attention slide down the back of your head. Feeling your head resting on anything that might be supporting it. Feeling the length in the back of your neck. And letting your attention travel down into your throat. And down into your collarbone. Feeling the spreading at the base of the back of your neck and letting your attention move down to your shoulders, your upper arms, your elbows, your forearms, your wrists, feeling your hands, the palms of your hands, the backs of your hands. Feeling all 10 fingers, all the way to the tips of your fingers, noticing any tingling or subtle sensations that might be present there. And feel your chest as it rises and falls with your breathing. Feel your upper back. Your shoulder blades, 
Feel your mid-back and your low back. Feeling your belly as it rises and falls with your breathing. Feel your hips and your bottom resting heavily on the chair or the cushion that's supporting you. Feel your outer hips, the fronts of your thighs, the backs of your thighs, stretching down to your knees, feeling your lower legs, stretching down to your ankles, feel the soles of your feet. Feel the tops of your feet and feel all 10 toes stretching down to the tips of your toes. Now see if you can feel your whole body at once as a unified field of shifting sensation. As you allow your awareness just to linger in this field of shifting sensation, see if you can bring your attention to the limits of your physical body. Maybe even noticing if you can reach out with your attention beyond those limits of your physical body to start to feel into the space around you. Now bring your attention to the tip of your nose and start to observe your breath as it enters and exits at the tip of your nose. And for the moment, don't do anything to shape or control your breath, but just observe the sensations that are present as the air passes in and out through your nostrils. And allow yourself to become curious about your breath. Start to notice anything you can about the breath. Maybe observing that the breath feels a little cooler on the way in a little warmer on the way out. And when you're ready, add a silent count to make your exhalations last twice as long as your inhalations. So on your next inhalation, just count along with your breath. And if you find that you inhale for a count of five, see if you can make your exhalation last for a count of 10. If you inhale for a count of eight, make your exhalation last for a count of 16. And if you find that stretching the exhalation out 
creates any anxiety in your body and just slightly shorten the duration of the exhalation. And just continue breathing in this way, using the count of your breath and making your exhalations last twice as long as your inhalation. Bring now your attention back to your physical body. Start to see if you can direct your attention to the left side of your body. Just feeling everything you can on the left side of your face, your left arm left side of your chest and your back, your left leg. Now shift your attention to the right side of your body. Just allowing your attention to spread out so that you can feel your face, the right side of your face, your right arm, the right side of your chest, your right leg. And shift your attention back to the left side of your body. And then shift your attention back to the right side of your body. And 
Now see if you can feel both sides of your body at once, both the right and left sides of your body at once. And from here, bring your attention to any places where you are feeling some tension in your body. Really try to stay with the physical experience in your body. So just allow your attention to seek out any places where you feel some tension or some tightness or some restriction. And just allow your attention to explore that area. Noticing any thoughts or feelings that might be associated with that physical sensation. And then shift your attention now to any place in your body where you feel open, where there's a kind of ease or spaciousness, a lack of restriction. Now shifting your attention back to any place in your body where you feel that tension, that tightness, or that restriction, gripping or holding. Feel it. Explore it with your attention. Now shift your attention back to any place in your body where you feel open or at ease, where there's a kind of spaciousness, a lack of restriction. Now see if you can feel at one time in your body both the feeling of that tension or restriction and that sense of ease and spaciousness and openness. Holding both of these experiences in your attention at one time. And then from here, let's take a moment to recall that intention that you set for yourself at the beginning of this practice. And start to notice how it forms a bridge between this practice and whatever else 
it is that you feel you need to do. So if that means going to sleep now and getting a good night's rest, you can go ahead and roll over, go to sleep, sleep through the night. Or if you are ready to come back to wakefulness, you can slowly start to deepen your breathing. When you feel ready to move again, start small, maybe wiggling your fingers and your toes. And in your own time, whenever you feel ready, you can start to open your eyes. And Resume whatever it is that you were going to do before you started your meditation. So if that's going to bed or fixing yourself a plate of nachos to binge watch The Expanse or something like that, then go ahead. But I hope that wherever you're at, that you find this practice useful to help you get some rela release from stress Maybe to, again, find a good night's sleep if that's something you've been having trouble doing. And uh, remember that if you missed the beginning of this video, you can go back to the beginning. And again, maybe a good thing to do right before you're going to sleep. Um, and if you're interested in finding more practices like this, there's lots of material available on YouTube. I'll try to post this video on YouTube uh, as well. There's lots of material from lots of other people um, that has a lot higher production value than this. Um, so anyway, I hope everyone's doing well and, uh, have a good night. Thanks.